media, Canadians are already tired of your stunts, and we've already begun tuning you out. Your constant twisting effects to elicit rage and reaction are neither wanted, appreciated, or working. As demonstrated by the fact your incessant whinging failed to cost this government even a single seat in Parliament this last election. In my less than humble opinion, all Canadian media deserves to be boycotted for their incessant and petty high school level badgering of public servants. People that so-called journalists want us to believe aren't allowed to have any private time anymore. People that these jaundiced hacks won't leave alone even for a minute, particularly if it provides their lowest common denominator and rapidly dwindling audience yet another opportunity to flame them for cheap partisan points. The Prime Minister might apologize because he's Canadian. This bear is telling you to knock it off or go back to America where you belong. <laughs> On this day in 1383, the male line of the Portuguese House of Burgundy became extinct with the death of King Fernando, leaving only his daughter Beatrice. Rival claimants began a period of civil war and disorder. Stop, stop, stop. I'm not dealing with another Disney lawsuit. <laughs> it's also Caps Lock Day, International Stuttering Awareness Day, Nut Day, and Smart is Cool Day. <laughs> Nerd. And that's today's Dunderbird Digest. See you tomorrow. Nerd.